Howdy folks and welcome to another stream of uh, Hearts of Iron 3 with me Field Marshal Lucky Luke uh, it's episode number 10 and we are playing with a mod called Black Ice it's version 10.2 now today I hope that our Wehrmacht will be able to take down France we've driven quite a wedge um, into France uh, their units are more or less busted, so we are in for the last uh, major push. <laughs> okay, so we've taken over Poland. We are pushing in France. Now the thing is that uh, I've been thinking off stream, um, we are going to probably try to take France as fast as humanly possible because there's an... Um, well Adolf told us uh, or instructed us to invade Yugoslavia as fast as possible and also we are going to go and try to take over Greece which means we have to get troops, we have to pull troops from the French um, front. Uh, we'll see how fast we can destroy this pocket. And uh, yeah, of course, before we invade Russia, we don't have much time, actually, more or less one year. Uh, we have to invade and take over Yugoslavia and Greece. So that's going to be the plan. Um, yeah, of course, there's been a lot of work done um, off stream. So let's go through it. First of all, I went in and uh, I've uh, set these tanks, I've upgraded the units that were available for upgrade because in one year, hopefully, we're gonna have more tanks. Now this is okay. So the next thing, yeah, because we have enough steel for now, I've put all the steel factories on the bottom and we've put three new factories to be built. So actually these were taken from the from the bottom. Um, I've done a lot of organization in regards to partisans. So we're gonna have, mm, these headquarters are empty, right? Uh, where are these? So, I've set up a complete, more or less a complete network of anti-partisan units um, and garrison units. As much as we have them, those are still uh, going towards the towards their destinations. So, for example, the whole chain of command has been built. Um, So we do have uh, partisan in uh, anti-partisan units in Western Germany, and in Denmark, and in France, northern side for now. Um, okay, I've also set um, more or less coastal defense units in Denmark. Okay, so they are all going up still. Um, an important thing is that we've changed an occupation policy policy for a few countries. Now this is also something new in this mod and I didn't know um, how this thing works. So um, for France that's, the decision is still not made uh, what we're going to do after the war. But for Denmark I've actually changed from a military government to total exploitation which means higher re uh, revolt risk less uh, manpower modifiers, so we'll get less soldiers for the front. Does this show up here? No. Um, but we are going to exploit their industry. This is minus 70, this is minus 20. Um, we'll, have, we'll get almost, well actually, no research from uh, these countries. Um, yeah, partisans are going to be a big problem, but I think we can quell the resistance and we'll get more resources from these countries. So probably this is going to be 
uh, the same in France. We'll see. We'll see. Um, now, oh yeah, and I've started some organization um, of the paratrooper units. Now these are quite uh, sort of fine. They will get an elite light infantry. Um, these units are going to get combined. This will be combined. And uh, because the war is in full swing, it's time to check the situation around the world. So mostly, um, okay, Mussolini is pushing, which is fine. But we'll definitely need to help him out. And um, we'll have to check what Japan is doing quite regularly now. So they are still in war with China. Hopefully after that is done they are going to go uh, for oil in the Philippines and down here. So Japan is sort of, I don't know, it's 1940 so I think they are good, uh, doing fine for now. Anyway, we have to change leaders, I don't know what I meant by that. That's something that needs to be done but needs to be done later on. Anyway. Let's start checking which units we can pull off the front. Oh boy, we're out of saving right away. Which is not bad, hopefully we'll not have uh, any crashes today. Anyway, we do have to push, we do have to push France. So this pocket is gonna get closed and we are going to, well, let's say have uh, a lot of POWs here. Now these units, the Balkans army, this could actually be pulled off the front. Ooh, boy, there's a lot of divisions. So let's send them here. Because we really, uh, really need to make the push into Yugoslavia. Um, I'm kind of worried that the war with um, with the Russia, with Soviet Union, uh, Soviet Union won't go as planned. <laughs> but <laughs> we'll do our best. Uh, now let's see. Factories are being built. Oh, the Hitler Jugend. I've uh, put additional 30 mil uh, militias, uh, military police. This is actually the military police. Um, and I will attach these units, though it's only one. I'll have to count when the organization is fully complete. I'll have to count how many we need, but uh, these are going to be attached to headquarters for anti-partisan um, units. Like these trains, this is the part anti-partisan unit, uh, actually headquarters for Holland. Oh, now this is awesome. So we are losing this and oil. Ugh. So Secretary of Public Information and Education informed us that we've researched. Abilities in Secretary of Public Information and Education. Nineteen forty two, uh, and it will only give us one per cent. Should we put it up? Of course we should. <laughs> we'll, need, we'll need every possible um, research point we can get. So let's move on. Yeah, we do have 
a lot of uh, guns. These are all the... Um, oh boy, how is it called? Train guns. for one okay ah okay this is the push that we are trying to do uh, towards Marseille we need to cut the Italians off otherwise they'll take the land <laughs> and we don't want that <laughs> we definitely don't want that Okay, noble. Now I'm just pushing through with the tanks. Other units are following. Now there's another city here somewhere. Oh, I guess they took it. Or this is Italy. So these uh, provinces can go to Italy, I don't care about much, uh, those much, so we're going to push through. Now these units are struggling. Mm. We need to attack more or less throughout the whole uh, front. Oh crap. Oh, we've lost this too. That's uh, that's okay. Too much is going to this. It should be 75. It's going to be enough. Uh, descent. No more descent. doing here they are holding so what we are going to do is we are going to bomb them ground attack during the day let's say six days no not aggressive defensive and let's go uh, day defensive one, two, three, four, five, six, okay, it should be fine. Ground attack defensive during the day. Okay, one's been knocked out. Awesome. This one won't last long if you ask me. Then we are going to move um, units, more units onto the front with... Um, with Yugoslavia and just run them over. Tanks. These tanks will take Jesus Christ to life five. That's not, not even going to be ready for um for Barbarossa operation. Ah it's 1940 so it will be sorry. We have one. Okay. Oh no, this is nice. Agriculture investment will go right back on the top, even though it's 42. Now, how long will it take for these guys to break? So, we are using the blitz tactics. Okay. Okay, we are pushing here. Now these ones are beating, uh, but we'll we'll break through. It shouldn't be a problem. So we've won. Oh boy! Now a lot of work awaits us. So we are going to go uh, behind closed doors with Adolf. See, we've got the um, wolf slayer doors. Now, let's see which units we can uh, send to the front with Yugoslavia. Oh boy, no 
first of all we need to check all the units are in um, close enough the headquarters if the headquarters are close enough I think they are so five divisions can send them down here no problem so you guys go to Spital to Graz you're going to uh, strategically redeploy them yeah that way they'll move there faster to Graz as well move them to Morau Morau hmm. okay this should probably be enough. We don't have any tank divisions that would be free. Um, but I think we'll do without them. Which one is this? 7th Infantry. Well, let's send them as well. Blaskovitz. We'll send them to Spital. is free for the taking let's go in with this tanks are going to do go down to Marseille industrial production advance I see I see efficiency yeah we're going to put this on uh, this one on top as well Actually, these are motorized infantry, so these are fast. Yeah, we're running over France, which is awesome. Panzer division that's being upgraded. <laughs> so we boxed them in. Time to kill off these units. Actually, let's move them there. Yeah, we're just driving them, driving them back. They are still bombing us, but uh, I don't think they do uh, much damage there. This 
reserves, they won't last long. This is pushing. Finland is mobilizing. Oh, interesting. Okay, so these guys are gonna get run over. Aha, now we have to combine these units. Ah, I remembered what I meant by the um, move the leaders around. The Chili Raiders. Um, oh, they have seven brigade. Actually, they can get one more unit into the brigade. Um, and what I'm going to do... Oh, well, I'll have to find them. But there are leaders. Um, I know that Kleist is in the 5th infantry unit. For example, um, first army, fifth infantry. Oh, sorry, Manstein. Now this is a leader. This gives huge bonuses to the unit that it is in. Now it's pointless to have him in the um, in the headquarters simply because um, this unit will not fight. Um, but these Chili Raiders, our main tanks will so i will move the leaders into these units that will make them extremely extremely strong so we have improved our abilities in giant infrastructure projects we can build one more now let's see what we can build I'm going to save the game first. So, we'll have to wait for that. Could be till the end of the month. We need to cut them off here before they manage to get uh, to get Marseille. We have one. We have one. These are light pants, right? Yeah, because uh, they are fast. Slavia still hoping we won't uh, run them over, but that's kind of a lost hope if you ask me. I don't know what these units are taking so long. Yeah, this is the problem. After every attack the unit needs to wait, uh, hold like uh, for a while before it can attack again. Now the thing is that we are um, lowering the time 
with research, but uh, that's not that fast. Ooh, this is good. Nuclear research. Recon unit training. Okay, fine. Something has just popped off the production line. I mean the research line. Interesting. This is constantly going up. I think it's because of the factories that are being repaired. Okay, now this is okay. Home front coordination advance. Unit cooperation repair rate. Interesting. 